this is your devotional reading today for june 16th heavenly attributes from the book from the heart john 17 17 says sanctify them by your truth your word is truth every moment of our probationary time is precious for it is our time for character building we should give most diligent heed to the culture of our spiritual nature we should watch our hearts guarding our thoughts, lest impurity tarnish the soul. We should seek to keep every faculty of the mind in the very best condition that we serve God to the extent of our ability. Nothing should be permitted to interrupt our communion with God. We have a work to do in this world and we must not allow ourselves to become self-absorbed and so forget the claims of God and humanity upon us. If we seek God with earnestness, he will impress us by his Holy Spirit. He knows what we need for he is acquainted with our every weakness and he would have us work away from self that we may become kind in thought and word and deed. We must cease to think and talk of self, making our needs and wants the sole object of our thoughts. God would have us cultivate the attributes of heaven. How patiently should we bear with the faults and errors of our brothers when we remember how great our own failings in the sight of God? How can we pray to our Heavenly Father, forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors if we are denunciatory, wow, resentful, exacting in our treatment of others? God would have us more kind, more loving and lovable, less critical and suspicious. Oh, that we all might have the spirit of Christ and know how to deal with our brethren and neighbors. There are too many among us who profess to be followers of Christ, who seek to excuse their own defects by magnifying the mistakes of others. We should copy the example of Jesus, for when he was reviled, he reviled not again, but committed himself to him that judges righteously. He was the majesty of heaven, and in his pure breast there dwelt no room for the spirit of retaliation, but only for pity and love. We may not remember some act of kindness, which we do. It may fade from our memory, but eternity will bring out in all its brightness every act done for the salvation of souls, every word spoken for the comfort of God's children. And these deeds done for Christ's sake will be a part of our joy through all eternity. Hope you have a great day today. Live from the heart.